that that said, um, because I think we have much work to do with the DA. I, I sat in a meeting where he said that when there is an officer involved in a shooting, he gives an extra look at whether or not that person should be charged. And I think we're all seeing the extra look. Mm -hmm. um, yes. If you or I had shot somebody, we wouldn't get that extra look. Amen. He's going through the defenses that the officer might raise in order to determine what he's going to charge. That is not the job of a prosecutor. Mm -hmm. He should charge what he's going to charge and let the defense counsel raise whatever appropriate defenses. He is acting inappropriately. Yeah. Yeah. That said, I believe your board has acted inappropriately. Um, you, I, I am so tired, and I'm yes, sorry yes. that I missed the comments of, of Supervisor Carson. I am so tired of coming to meetings on this issue, and we're not a step further, not a step further than we were the day it happened. Mm -hmm. That's right. You scheduled a, yet another meeting for Monday, and, and, and it's to talk about the committee that you're going to organize to talk about this issue. When are you going to agendize an action item and take some action? Yeah. 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 Take, yeah. take some real action, Carol. Take some real action. Take some real to tell citizens that you you're going to put on a, a website your policies and procedures does not change them. You all have to you have to agendize the changing of those policies and procedures. You should have looked at each and every one of you by now. By now. You should be asking questions about what happened and what did not happen. And that does not appear from an outsider looking in is what is happening. What disciplinary measures are you looking at with respect to these officers? What, what retraining are you thinking about for your officers? There are a host of things that I'm just not seeing proactively you are doing. You responded only because a community became outraged. That's right. Only because a community became outraged. You right. should have been equally outraged and have been, been, been proactive yourselves. Yep. Something is desperately, desperately wrong with this picture. And if you guys can't take action, let us know, because there are those of us who are willing to jump in there. But by virtue of your authority, you have to do the action. So if we need to write it for you, let us know. <laughs> Give us your policies and procedures, well, and we can review you them. Do anything for me. Let me make that clear. You know what? That is way out of line, given That's that nothing right. has been That's done. Right. It That's is clear right. That's right. that Someone something died. has to be done. That's we right. have to buy cut the bow. We have got to have action. And it's real unfortunate that Ms. Ward Allen has decided to get up because now it's about her, not about the issue of Well, it may be. And, it and may we be. need to focus on thing, what we need to focus on. The death of us, the brand, right. the failure of policies right. of art to protect Execution, execution. You're that been on the world is. news, on France news, all over the world. Execution. Yeah. It is unacceptable. So what, what, what we would like to see happen is there were some demands that were placed before you at the hearing last Thursday. I'd like a sense of the board that you're committed to following up each and every one of those demands. Councilmember Brooks, I can tell you from this, this director's perspective, we are, um, I am 100% committed to getting those answers. We have been pushing to get those answers. My hope is that tomorrow, in our pool session, we will have something from our staff that will address the issues that you brought to us. I am grateful that you all put that in writing because it did give us a boilerplate to work from. Getting those procedures out to the public should have happened day number one. It really should have. So I have the future before taking the initiative. And I do appreciate you calling those community meetings because it did give us an opportunity to hear the voice of the community and to get a lot of the questions that they want to answer down. Trying to get them. Now sometimes it's like pulling people, we're trying to get them. And I apologize for Carol. She has been working overtime on just this issue. And I do apologize that she's walked out, but I'm sure she'll be right back. This is no disrespect to you or the people that you represent, but I think what we're all trying to get at is the truth and definitely get into some justice. We are as tired of this time lag as you are. Now trust me, I want to know what happened, and I want to see something else other than meeting for the sake of meeting, for the sake of committee. We're done with that. Let's get some action done, and I'm with you.